Congrats on the new uh, oh, recent release from Small Pond. Then friend of mine here, and also you got cassette tape uh, from Rodentia Collective. Uh, I'm just like really happy, like really excited to have my stuff out in Japan as well. It's like, yeah, really never thought I'd be able to do that. So, yeah. Great. Did you get the cassette tape? Uh, not oh. yet, but apparently it's coming within the next week or so. So, yeah. Great, great, really, exciting. It looks really beautiful. Like, I've never seen anything like that before. It's like really, um, like the the girl who's made it has put like loads of like hay in it and flowers and like yeah, it's really nice, a nice little compact thing. So seems like there has been a lot going on since the release. How's the reaction so far? Yeah, like yeah, I'm really happy with how it's gone. And I had some like radio stuff and like did some live sessions and. Was never expecting anything to do with the radio, so that was really cool. And then, um, yeah, I've like played some shows, and yeah, I'm happy with like how people are reacting to it. Uh, yeah, it's it's really nice. It's like reached more people than I expected. So, yeah. Great. <laughs> uh, you released this time from Small Pond Records. So, could you tell us how you come to work with these guys? Well, I like really. I knew them already because I like know their bands and I really like their music. So, um, yeah, like Physics House Band and Delta Sleep. So then they just kind of were talking to me about like, if I had any releases coming up and stuff, and that's how the conversation started. Yeah, and then they like wanted to put out an album because I was just going to put out an EP. Um, mm -hmm. So they, we were kind of like looking back on like what I'd written and recorded over the last few years to like put together kind of a collection of songs mm -hmm. um, so yeah it was really cool working with them what is <laughs> awesome uh, so let me ask you about the recording process this time mm -hmm. so how's the recording process in general for this um, new album so, yeah so I recorded it in a barn in Hastings with my producer called Martin Ruffin and um, yeah, I worked with him on houses as well and like a demo before that. So um, I just kind of sent him lots of demos of just like the uh, recordings and then we like got to the barn and added like kind of percussion and like all the kind of like reverby stuff as well like during the recording process. Um, uh, so how did you guys come to work together with? Uh, he was a promoter probably about seven years ago, so he put me on at a show and then he was like, oh, I want to get into producing, so um, we just did like a, a demo at the time, mm -hmm. so, and then he's kind of like grown within the seven years to sort of, at the time it was like, he just kind of did it for free as a friend and then like when we did houses he was like a bit more pro and now he's like pretty pro at it, so it's really cool to, have, I think both of us have kind of grown in that sense. Before you go in to record, the, your songs kind of sound quite different, kind of live version to recorded version. Is there a kind of like a definite end sound that you want or is it kind of going in and trying stuff? Yeah, I think it, a lot of it is, so like most of it, the, the arrangements and stuff I'll have like written so I kind of have an idea of like where it's heading. Um, and like especially like the band song, like like Liar song that's on there, like we all did that beforehand. Um, and then yeah, I would sort of add like harmonies and piano parts and like, other guitar parts and stuff in my room. Um, so I kind of had a, a rough idea and then um, yeah, we would like expand on it, I guess. Yeah. In your album, uh, there's a song you mentioned earlier, uh, Liar song. Mm hmm. Uh, so I, I was watching the music video and in the description uh, it was mentioned that you created a video, right? Yeah. The, uh, stop motion animation. Mm -hmm. uh, so for viewers, this time I asked Natalie to bring in the artwork uh, to just for the presentation and show check. us like what it looks like. Did you have it? I do. I just got a quick check. I didn't look at it. Yeah, it's all in. It's all still in one piece. That's good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. So, um, it's the liar heart, which is like what the song is based around, and then 
Yeah. Um, there's like a computer scene, so there's a like a typing one on here, and I like changed the um, the color of the card for each letter, so it was like it was typing, and then the words like came up on the screen, uh, the letters like one by one, and then made a window for the because it sort of begins in the morning, so there's like birds and like kites, and then it ends at night, so like the back of this was, was then like black and it had like a moon moving around and yeah. Um, so. <laughs> the birds are also like paper cut work? Yeah, yeah, it's all, all paper cut, yeah, out of card and stuff, so yeah, there were like lots of birds <laughs> and because you have to make them look like they're flying, it's like you, I would sort of like interchange that as they move across, it's like you start with a bird in one position and then to make it look like it's moved you have to I would swap it in with a different bird so that it looked like it had changed position and then just but then you're doing that for like twenty birds, it's like, <laughs> 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 it's like uh, yeah. how did you come up with that idea? Um I was gonna make a really simple stop motion video because I'd never done anything like it and then I accidentally like made it a bit more like detailed than I planned and then I just kinda kept going. And I I didn't have an idea really until I started and um, so I started off with this one with the um, keyboard and then because that there's like quite a lot of detail I was kind of like okay I'm just gonna commit to this uh, and then yeah was, from then I guess I, I knew that it was like someone was gonna be typing and then I wanted to um, try and have other scenes that would be more about like what the song was about and um, yeah so the story like very much just developed as it was going rather than um, beforehand. Yeah. Right. Do you think you'll do that again or? Yeah, I'm actually like yeah. it's only yesterday I like, started doing another kind of stop motion thing. Um so yeah, I might I like really I, like the idea of um kind of like little short stories or something, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Cool, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, uh, thank you for connecting with us. Thank you. It was, yeah, it's really nice. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, it's enjoyed great. Enjoyed Great to yeah. chat. Yeah, definitely. Nice to yeah. talk to you, fine. Yeah, same. <laughs>